just come to check the tunnels at Dalkin and that's what they've done. They've cut bushes down and uh, they've piled it up so you can't get in. So the entrance, hang on a minute, I've got my hands full. The entrance is over there over there somewhere the entrance but I'll give it a go and if I get in I'll be back they have stacked up the entrance with branches and that now so you have to climb over the stuff to get in um, and it ain't easy when you've got crops on <laughs> I lost one in the, in the uh, rubbish like the bushes so um, yeah, so I've just put a couple of, like the red pod and the cat ball out at the moment. But as I said, Trevor should be in a minute once he's finished flying his drone. Um, we ain't been here for a while. It's just to see if it happens. As I say, it's only a short one, a short visit. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to try and do a bit of cooling out now anyway. See if we can get anything. Right, any spirits here that wishes to communicate? Oh, that's a drip. Better move my phone out of the way. There's a little red light in the middle of the floor. If you go near it, it will make a noise. And there's two little round balls that I've put out on the floor. If you touch them, they will flash colour. If you are here, do you want to come forward? Can you use the devices that are on the floor? Me and Trevor have been here quite a few times over the years. We've spoken to a lady, we've spoken to a gentleman.
come on, come and join us. I might try it down another aisle. You always do here. I'm going to try down here, which I haven't filmed down here for years, well, haven't done much down this end for a long time. Oh, that's me. Maybe try here. Right, any spirits here? This is where sometimes we hear your voice. That's dripping, that noise. Can you see the red light in the middle of the floor there, the doorway? That's my stomach. Don't know what that noise was before, it might have been the aeroplane. Can you see the two little round balls on the floor? Can you make them flash? Is. Don't know if that's outside or not. Come on, can you touch those little round balls that are on the floor, please? a bird or something. <clears throat> That's my stomach. And that bleeping noise is Trevor the drone. Any soldiers here? Can you flash that red light for me, please? If you just stand near the aerial, that metal bar. That's 
As I said, we're not here for long. There's a lot of dripping in there, I'm afraid. Like the old condensation or whatever it is. It's all dripping off the metal. <coughs> Come on, we've spoken to quite a few spirits here over the years. Just let us know that you're still here. Why is that so blurry? Can you go towards the red light, please? Maybe you don't want to communicate, do you? You just don't want to talk, do you? Maybe we go outside. Would you like that? Please just go near that long metal bar where the red light is. Can you try? Oh well, we might go to the doorway, aren't we? So <coughs> anyone here? Anyone at this entrance that would like to speak? Would you like to communicate now?
As you can see, them objects that I've put on the floor will not harm you. All they are, them two little round balls that flash are um, cat balls. They're pet balls for the cat to play with. And the red light, that will flash colour plus make a noise. But again, it will not harm you. I've used these in here before. Right, it was only a little visit, as I've just said. We've done a couple of little sections, done a bit of cooling out. Um, it is pretty quiet in here. There is quite a bit of drip, like dripping that's coming from the metal. Um, so... <coughs> I mean, there's no point with the dripping sound, you know. Um, obviously, I'm in here on my own because Trevor's still outside at the moment. But you never know, I might pick up a couple of uh, voices, you never know. So, um, yeah, but I'd say it was only a quick visit so Trevor can do his drone again. And uh, you never know, I might be lucky to come back, but. Now I've got to try and get back out, climbing all that, which you will see um, when I leave. So here we go, let's have some fun getting out. This is the first hurdle. See, that's all died down now, but that was stacked similar to that, but not as high. So, there's got to be an easy way of getting up. What's up this way? Oh, watch me. Ren pod. Right, hang on. Oh. Oh. There we go. I'm up. <laughs> That's where I climbed there. I just climbed all that all the way down to get round the corner there. But it's well and truly stacked up. Let's see if I can get through here. Right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take my light off. Um, so I don't drop it. So just bear with me for a minute. Oh, I can't get it in my pocket. So you go around that little corner there. Yeah, so you go around there. But I came the awkward way by um, going up that bank there to get past all this, all this lot. But I think this could have been the easy way, I think. thing is you can't see where your feet are going so you don't know how deep but I'm getting there there we go now get through this tree here there you go hopefully I'll get out through these trees I'm out. There you go. So, but yeah. So, as I said, I was over there. If you could see a brick wall, and I just went round it, climbed over this. They're definitely trying to 
stop people going in but I'm sure as this dies down it'd be easier to get in but I think next time maybe go that way through the bush instead of going up there but yeah <laughs> Thank you.